In this video, I'll be showing you how to fix the Minecraft launcher not working. So if you're having issues with the Minecraft launcher not opening in Windows, then there's a few things that we can do to fix this issue. But before we get started, I just want to say I will pop a link in the description below to a guide that we will do on how to fix the Minecraft launcher not working. So if we do come across more methods, then we will add them to that guide. So check out the link in the description below if none of the methods in the video help. So the first thing that you want to do is just ensure that you have closed down all the programs that are running in the background. So if you have programs like Firefox, Edge, Chrome, Music Players, RGB software like Razer's Snaps, Gigabyte RGB Fusion, or even Logitech G Hub, close them all down. This also includes programs that you use for streaming like OBS Studio. Just basically make sure you have closed everything down. And once you have, go ahead and launch the Minecraft launcher again as one of these programs could have been conflicting with the launcher, causing it to not open. So once you've done that, and if that didn't help, then the next thing that we want to do is run the Minecraft launcher as an administrator. So we can do this easily by opening up the start menu and then finding Minecraft in the list. Once you've found Minecraft launcher, right click on it and then go to more and then simply click on run as administrator. This is now going to launch it with administrator privileges and will hopefully help resolve the issue you're having. As you can see there, it's now searching for an update and then it should open up the launcher on my computer. If that didn't help fix the issue for you, then the next thing that we want to do is open up File Explorer. Once you've opened File Explorer, you now need to click in the address bar and you then need to do the percentage symbol and you then need to type in app data and then do the percentage symbol again and then press enter. Okay, so we are now looking for the .minecraft folder. So as you can see, it's at the top of the list here. We need to open up this folder. We now need to find the launcherprofiles.json file. So as you can see, it's just here. You need to right click on this file and then go to rename. Next, you need to add BK to the end of profiles and then press enter on your keyboard. Once you've renamed that file, go ahead and launch the launcher again and see if that helped. If that didn't help, then you can always delete the new file that's created and you can then simply rename this file back. So the next thing that we want to do is simply right click on the start menu icon and you then need to go to apps and features. Next, you need to click and search this list and we then need to type in Minecraft. You now need to select the Minecraft launcher and you then need to go advanced options. We now need to scroll down and you then need to select terminate and you then need to click on repair. And this is just going to make sure that none of the launcher's files have become corrupted or missing. Once you've got a tick next to repair, go ahead and try and open the Minecraft launcher again. If that didn't help, then the next thing that we want to do is click on reset and you then need to click on reset again. And this is just simply going to reset the app's files, hopefully resolving the issue. So now you've got a tick next to reset, go ahead and try and open the Minecraft launcher. If that didn't help, then the next thing that we want to do is simply scroll down and then click on the uninstall button and uninstall the Minecraft launcher. And once the Minecraft launcher has been uninstalled, then all you need to do is open up the store. Once open, you then need to search for Minecraft and you then need to select the Minecraft launcher and you then need to click on install and make sure you have the Minecraft launcher selected. It will now begin to install the Minecraft launcher back to your Windows computer. Once it's finished, go ahead and try opening the Minecraft launcher again and hopefully that would have fixed the issue. So like I said, if none of the methods in the video didn't help fix the issue that you're having with the launcher, then check out the link that's in the description below to a guide that we will do, which will hopefully have more methods on things that you can do to fix the issue that you're having with it not opening. So I hope this video helped you out and you enjoyed it. If you did like the video, click the like button below. And if you want to see another computer sluggish video, then click that subscribe button. If you do subscribe, then I will see you in the next video.